నా కుటుంబ సభ్యులకు నమస్కారం హెల్లో మై ఫ్యామిలీ మెంబర్స్ టుడే విల్ సాల్వ్ సమ్ ప్రోగ్రామింగ్ లాజిక్ అండ్ సివ్డో కోడ్ ప్రాబ్లమ్ దట్ వాజ్ ఆస్క్డ్ ఇన్ ఎక్స్టెన్షన్ ఆఫ్ క్యాంపస్ టూ ఆన్ ట్వంటీ జూన్ డ్రైవ్ ఇట్ విల్ బి బెటర్ ఇఫ్ యూ జస్ట్ వాచ్ ద క్వశ్చన్ అండ్ సాల్వ్ బై యువర్ సెల్ఫ్ రైట్ అండ్ ఇఫ్ ఇఫ్ యూ ఫేస్ ఎనీ ప్రాబ్లమ్ దెన్ కమ్ టు వాచ్ రైట్ అండ్ దేర్ విల్ బి త్రీ క్విజెస్ ఫర్ యూ సో enhance your problem solving ability by solving them and give the output in the comment box right and you know i would request you to please watch the playlist regarding previous year paper link will be given in the description box and please subscribe this channel let's start the questions so first question is this pause the video think a little and solve the problem give the output right okay i am solving for convenience actually i have written the code so the value of p q and r were initialized right and it is checking if p 5 less than q that is 5 less than 7 uh, it is actually satisfying right so in case of uh conditional or operation we don't have to check the rest part of the condition because we already have a condition true so we don't have to check rest part right so we have to go in the if block so q is equal to q and operation r so q means 7 and r means 9 right so 0 1 1 1 is the value of 7 and 1 0 0 1 is the binary value of 9 right so uh, in case of and operation 1 and 1 is 1 and 1 uh, and 0 is 0 1 and 0 is 0 0 and 1 is 0 so 0 0 0 1 is the value right 0 0 0 1 right it is the value of binary value right so this is the decimal value 1 right and if again it is checking in the nested if block that is p plus r or q so p means 3 right and r means 9 and q means new value 1 right so 9 zor q that is what 9 means 1001 and 1 means 0001 in case of zor operation 1 and 1 is false and 0 is 0 0 and 0 also false right that means they are 0 but 1 and 0 is true right that means 1 right so 1 and 1 is 0 right and 0 and 0 is also 0 right and 0 and 0 also 0 and 1 and 0 is 1 right so 1 0 0 0 right so that means it is the value of 8 right so this is the value of 8 so 3 plus 8 is equal to 11 and 1 or 3 if you do the same process then you will get 2 right so 1 means 0 0 that means 0 1 right 1 means 0 1 and 3 means 1 1 right so 1 1 is 0 and 1 0 is 1 right so 1 0 means 2 right so this will be 2 so 3 plus 8 is equal to 11 is less than 2 it is not satisfying so it will not go into the nested if block right so it, it, it will now go to the outer part of the if block so now p is equal to 1 plus r so what is the value of r that was 9 and 1 plus r means 10 right and r is equal to 6 plus 10 plus q right 6 plus 10 means 16 and new value of q was 1 right so 6 plus 10 is equal to 16 plus 1 is equal to 17 right and now we have to print the total value of p plus q plus r that means p is equal to 10 q means uh, 1 here q means 1 right and r means 17 so total value will be 10 plus 1 plus 17 that is 28 so the answer will be 28 so now this is a quiz for you let's solve the problem and if you face any problem then come to watch i mean then obviously comment the problem and where you are facing problem then i will solve your problem in the comment box right okay let's go to the next problem actually the values of a and b were not in the screenshot right so i did i could not uh, initialize the value of a5 a and b right so i take it manually so pause the video and try to solve the problem okay i am solving the problem what's actually the code is this right 
so inside of the function actually the mechanism of the program wh where it starts it starts from main function right and when it face that there is a function then it calls the function right so it at first calls the function so when the function has initialized the value of 5 and 7 that is a is equal to 5 and b is equal to 7 then at first it is going inside a it will go inside a if block if the condition satisfies right so at first check a minus 7 a minus 7 that means 5 minus 7 right that is minus 2 and b is or a uh b is or a means 7 is or 5 right 7 is triple 1 and 5 is 1 0 1 right and uh, this value will be 2 how 1 and 1 is 0 1 and 0 is 1 and 1 1 is 0 so the value will be 1 0 actually right so 1 0 means the value of 2 right so 2 and and the end operation so uh, 1 minus b right actually minus 2 less than 2 right so minus 2 less than 2 it's satisfying so i have to check both condition if this would have been false then we would not have to check both condition because in case of and operation i mean in case of conditional and operation we don't have to check both condition if one condition is false right so uh, now we will check 1 minus b right so 1 minus b means 1 minus 7 that is minus 6 and less than b minus a b minus a means 7 minus 5 2 so obviously minus 6 is less than 2 right so we will go inside the if block so b is equal to 2 plus 1 plus a that means 2 plus 1 is equal to 3 plus a means 5 so 3 plus 5 means 8 and a is equal to a plus 2 right a, a means 5 and plus 2 means 7 so a is equal to new value is 7 and return the function so it is actually recursively uh, again uh, uh, calling the function itself right so b plus 1 means uh, 8 plus 9 so b was 8 and now a value is initialized as 8 plus 9 1 that is 9 right and b is still 8 so a is equal to now 9 and b is equal to 8 so a is equal to 9 means uh, the 9 minus 8 right 9 minus 8 means 1 so this value is 1 right so 8 zor 9 what will be the operation 8 means uh, sorry 9 means 1 0 0 1 and 8 means 1 0 0 0 that right so we, if we do zor operation on this so what will be the value 1 and 1 is 0 0 and 0 is 0 0 and 0 is 0 1 and 0 is 1 right so this will be the value of 1 so 1 less than 1 no that means we 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 should not go check we should not go to check further condition because this is conditional and operation right so we will go to the return part right out of the if block right so what was the value what was the value the value of a was 9 and b was 8 right so we will return a plus b minus 1 so a is equal to 9 b is equal to 8 9 plus 8 is equal to 17 minus 1 is equal to 16 and we will now print 16 right so the value of this pseudo code i mean the output is 16 right so this will be answer i hope you have got the logic now it is again a quiz for you kindly solve the problem and if you face any problem any issue then kindly comment down i will love to solve the problem okay now let's go to another is another coding question actually it is saying that give the output of the given c code right i know you have that ability to solve the problem though i am explaining a little bit right so at first a is equal to 14 and here a uh, while loop it's checking the value of a until the value of a is 19 uh less than 20 it will go to in, go inside the while loop right as soon as it enter into the while loop the value of a will be increased by one right so a is, a is equal to 14 at first where when it enters the value of a will be 15 right it will be increased by one so at first value of a is 15 and it will check if a greater than 16 or a less than equal to uh, 18 or 
or uh, this is not or this is and right so when the value of a will be 17 and 18 17 and 18 right so this will continue that means skip the value when the value will be 17 and 18 this will skip the value and go to the while condition again right and if not matches then print the value right so print the value of a that means 15 at the first iteration and the second iteration will be a less than 15 a sorry 15 less than 20 yes so it will go and a will be 16 now a will be 16 now right so a greater than 16 no it not matches so go again print 16 right so it will print 16 and again go to check the while loop so 16 less than 20 yes so again it is increased by 1 so new value will be 17 right so it will check the value in the if block 17 greater than 16 yes and 17 less than equal to 18 yes so it will continue that means it will skip the uh, skip the iteration and go to check the while loop again so 17 less than 20 yes it will go inside while loop and it will increase by 1 so value of a will be 18 and if it will check again 18 greater than 16 yes and and 18 less than equal to 18 yes it is equal so it will again continue to while loop while condition right it will skip the iteration so again 18 less than 20 so plus plus say that means new value of it a will be 19 right so 19 greater than 16 yes and and 19 less than equal to 18 no it will go to the outer instead if loop right so this will print 19 right and it will go to here right a is 19 now so 19 less than 20 yes 19 less than 20 so plus plus a that means the new value of a will be 19 plus 1 that is 20 so 20 greater than 16 and then this not this actually does not satisfy so it will again print the value of a so the total output will be this 15 16 19 20 right so this will be the output uh, the problem occurs here is many of the candidates do the problem and give the output only up to this 15 16 and 90 this is the actually confusional part right so i hope you have uh, gathered a little bit knowledge here and he will solve this problem as well right i hope you will solve all the quizzes given in this session and will give the output in the comment box and you will prove that your proficiency in pseudocode and pro programming logic is now increasing right so for today i will request just you to watch the playlist regarding pseudocode i mean uh, cognitive assessment and technical assessment uh, regarding playlist and please subscribe this channel thank you